here at, at River Bend Park in Smithville, Texas, and I'm going to share with you today the joy of Dutch oven cooking. I've been cooking most of my life in Dutch ovens, and it's just a fabulous, fabulous taste you get over an open fire in the official equipment for the state of Texas. That's right, you barbecuers. It's the Dutch oven. Uh, you can't beat that scrumptious taste you get out of cast iron. Got to remember, our ancestors used to cook in Dutch ovens, pioneers as they crossed the plains. Cowboy cooks in their chuck wagons for many years used the Dutch oven to cook out of. It acts just like your oven at home. As you can see right here, we've got a lid with a rim, which holds the coals on top. And you can see this lovely black color is from all the use of this Dutch oven. It makes it almost nonstick. This is natural nonstick. Been here a long time before Teflon. For taking care of the Dutch oven, we never use soap on it. And when I store my Dutch oven, I always have a little piece of paper in here. This piece of paper keeps some of the moisture and helps it to wick out and keeps rust from forming, which is just bad for a Dutch oven. We look, we've got a nice little handle here. It's something we can use for lifting the Dutch oven. And another key part of this for an open fire Dutch oven are the legs. The legs on here keep it elevated above the coals so that air can circulate around them and produce the heat on the bottom. It's really a fabulous piece of equipment that you can cook with outdoors. Folks, don't be afraid to go out and buy yourself a Dutch oven and try things at home. In the next segment, I'm going to show you how to do a basic meal, one pot meal in a Dutch oven that anyone can do. The Dutch oven's very forgiving. So get out there, get yourself a Dutch oven. Y'all ready to eat? And enjoy a great meal with you and all your friends.